Well, hello and welcome back. Welcome back to part two of the Iron App Lunar Park. We're in downtown Iron Appa. We're going to take you along to the Helter Skelter. There's a couple of people having the life bungeed out of them, as you can see just over there. But before we show you any more, let me introduce you to the most beautiful woman in the world, Miss Orchin Brasilia Lobo. Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again. And again. Now, they're going to get bungeed again. They're getting ready to launch them. There they are, sitting in the trough, as they call it. They're checking them out. And they're done. There we are. So that was quite a short bungee jump. That's for sure. Right, let's get over here and see what is going on. Further seating area, when you get that bit tired, you've got one of those places where you can try your luck with darts or little rubber balls to see if you can win something, but very few people do, that's for sure. And then over here, well, you've got the roller coaster ride, and we watched it ramping up as we were entering the Lunar Park. And I tell you, it looks quite scary indeed. So there's quite a few people, well, having the life scared out of them, that's for sure. It's now parked up, as you can see, but you never know, as we mosey on down, maybe, some more guys might get on it and maybe up they will go again. It's one of those places where you drop a euro in and if you think you can be lucky, you never know, you could win one of those super, super teddies. But as we understand, not many people do. Receive your booth or one have a go. Yes, I do want you to win it, but you never will. How much is it for a go, receive your booth? Yeah, give me. All we have here is the world. Give me the word, give me. Give your 50 cents. Well, I'll says. give you a euro. It says a euro. Pop a euro in the machine. And? and <laughs> well, I don't know which one you want. You have a go. You fancy having one of those teddies, do you? No, that doggy. You want that doggy. I told you, you can go doggy that bit later. Right, off you go. Let's have a look and see if Ochin Grisivi Booth can get lucky. As predicted, no. But you never know, no. Do you get another go? No, there you go. Two goes for my Euro, didn't win anything. Nice doggy, but perhaps it can stay there that little bit longer. We all understand that Otting Receiver Booth does like a bit of doggy, so I promised her a little bit later. Well, you've guessed it, should be doggy. <laughs> if I had three, I would win. Yes, this is what every gambler always believes, especially when they're playing with someone else's money. Now, this is the place where you play what I think was old air football. So you have like a thing that knocks around and boop, 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 boop. But I've got no more money, that's for sure. Now, that was the great, great loop star. And as we were parking up, we watched them whizzing around there and they were screaming. And I mean screaming. There we go. Some great things to look at, by the way. And it's a lunar park that's free to enter, just so you understand. Uh, obviously, everyone understands when you enter a lunar park, if you bring children or a Gracibi Alibu, the odds are you're going to go out bankrupt. I'm already bald, but not quite bankrupt yet. And hopefully, reinforcements are coming in the name of Jeremy and Simon Payne. They promised me they're going to come and help relieve some of the pain. There we are. There's one of these massive jumping machines. So there's a lot of fun going to go on. There are a couple of new barriers in it and they're getting locked into place. So let's go and wait over here and just see what happens to the expression and the smile on their faces. Yeah, And they're getting strapped in over there as well. So you never know, you might have a damn good laugh in a moment. Hold on, here it goes. Have a look at that. Oh wow, I've got the feeling it's going to hit me on the head. I'm going to go and stand over here. Let's see if we can capture this. Wow. I don't think it gets any better than that. These people are in serious trouble, that's for sure. <laughs> 
absolute nutcases is a better word for it, Grisibi Alibu. If you want the life scared out of you, get yourself down to Ayanapa Luna Park, cross the palm with a few euros, and the chappy over there in the yellow t-shirt with staff on the back, well, he's gonna scare the living daylights out of you, that's for sure. Grisibi, do you want to have a go? I swallowed the tongue. No, thank you very much. Otherwise, I'll have diarrhea up there in the air. Grisibi Labouf doesn't want to spend any more money, that's for sure. Let's get out the rear entrance of the Luna Park and see if we can capture it as it spins You're around. Always again. trying to scare me. Yeah, I just uh, I want the very quiet game to win a doggy, for example. Well, don't worry. I promised you a bit of doggy that little bit later. Let's see if we can grasp it as it spins around in all of its glory. Spectacle in itself. Have a look at that. It's ramping up for the final event. It's getting quicker and quicker. Then it slows down, and I think that's more scary than when you're going fast, to be honest. Now you can actually think about what's going on. Wow. I think it's something I've always thought about doing, but now I've actually watched it, no way in hell. I ain't doing that. Perhaps we can bring Jeremy and Simon down here, fleece them of a couple of bob, and perhaps we can get them to go on there. Obviously, I can't go in because I would need to film it. What do you Don't think, Jeremy and Simon? Boys. I'm going to scare the life out of those two boys when they come over here. That's for sure. Look at that. Oh. Has it run out of power? Has it run out of electricity? Let's hope not. Oh. Oh. Now, the two at the bottom think it's all over, that's for sure. And the two at the top, well, they're wondering, has he forgotten us and gone for a frappe? Let's wait and see just what happens. So they're being dismounted by the looks of it. I think he's forgotten about them and gone for a frappe after this, he's off for a frappe. So as you can see, they're dismounting. He's checking his app on the phone. He's thinking, where can I go for the frappe? And the poor ones at the top, well, we'll come back for them that little bit later. There were someone on the <laughs> anyway, top. thanks for watching. If you like but what you see, hit the like, click subscribe, come back for a little bit more about madness. Our madness. Was that but especially you know for Mr. Richie? Yes, of course, Mr. Richie. You know, Mr. Richie, in order to sit on there, there should be the doctor standing, sitting on the chair and checking your blood pressure and the heart situation. How strong is your heart? I would love to tell you many thanks for watching. We are loving you to visit. And don't forget to come and see another of our madnesses. I think Receiver Le Bouffe then was adjusting a rear end. There we go. It doesn't get much better than that. Thanks for watching. We're in downtown Ayanapa. And if you like Ayanapa, it could be the greatest place in the world to come for your holiday. And tomorrow, if you come back for our series of videos tomorrow and the next day and the next day and the next day, we're going to storm all of the streets of downtown Ayanapa. And we invite you to come with us and we're going to take you with us and we're going to show you some of the restaurants, some of the bars, some of the shops, some of the things that are going on. In the meantime, enjoy your day, your evening or your morning. And we wish you all the greatest success and all the love in the world. And we truly, truly thank you and appreciate you for watching. Thanks very much. That's what you call a dancing, wiggling pony. Thanks for watching.